All right, here we are with the next stage or the next video in the Mega Man Power Down game here. As we, or as I said last time, I'm going to go for Gutsman now, so yeah, that's what we're doing. And I assume we will be having those lifts in this stage, you know, but it will probably just be crash lifts because we don't have the original Mega Man 1 lifts in the game, obviously. Ah, a sip of water. Hmm. Whoa. Uh. Yeah, I'm just listening to the music there. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Dang, yeah, this is not going to work. No, I died! No! Gosh darn it, I died in the most stupid way. I did not see that the track ended there, so I jumped out and then it went back. Wow. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, so I died once then. Yeah, it kind of blended in a little bit into the background there. That's why I did not see it, I guess. Oi, oi, oi. Whoa, I did not see that either. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, these tiles here also kind of blends into the background. I honestly did not see them there. Mm hmm there we go. That's not the way to do it. Yeah, so like even though Mega Man has the special weapons, Proto Man still gets to... Whoa. <sighs> yeah, Proto Man gets to slide past certain segments there, so yeah. That's pretty cool. That he has his own perks, you know. I assume you can go down there, but since you have the main beam, obviously you need to go for this. Yeah, here we're just going to do that. Equip the elect beam now that we can use it. I'm totally going to abuse it. It's such a fun weapon to use, especially in the original game. Like, it's so helpful in that one. Going here was definitely worth it. Now we have one E tank there. Oh! We're going to need to use that to get out of here. Whoops. Wow. That was some nice usage there of the or with the freeze weapon. So you better not F up in here. Yeah, I'm not going for that. <laughs> so you better not F up in here because, yeah, you will get stuck in there. Like, I I'm sure you can just reset, you know, from checkpoint and, you know, you'll be fine. But yeah, still, don't, don't F up in there or you'll have to redo stuff. Daisy. Mm. Nope, that's... yeah, wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Now. Dang it. <laughs> I just keep getting nailed by this freaking meta there. Or what are they called? I call them method, but you know, <laughs> methods. Yeah, <laughs> doesn't sound so nice. And how the hell do you get that? I guess you use the magnet beam from down over there, but yeah, 
yeah, it's not worth it. <laughs> it's too, too risky, too risky. Especially when you have full health like I do. It would be foolish to go for it. And yeah, that should be it for that. Or it for that, it for this stage. As long as we can just destroy this guy. Let's just try oil man on this. Wow, that's definitely not it. Just the cutter? No, he's immune to that. It's not that either. It's gotta be this actually, yeah. He's weak to the bomb, yeah. Hmm. And you know what? It's actually going to be kind of tricky to walk under this guy now that we don't have a slide here. Yeah, you can just barely navigate under him. So this is actually quite interesting. Dang, dude, I might actually die here. Whew. I mean, I could use my E-Tank. I'm dead, yeah. I could have used my E-Tank, but yeah. You know what? I should have done it. No, it's just going to take more time to kill him. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? I'll do some cutting here so that we speed up the process. Okay, so yeah, here we are. I'm getting him down to half health. Uh, I actually realized I was stupid. You just... Yeah, just do this, you know. This way, you get in many more hits and, you know, you can just kind of kite him, you know. And then, you know, just pre-walk there and, as you can see, I still have my E-Tank, so... If you just, you know, don't panic as I did there on my first playthrough, you know, or my, my first playthrough, on my first attempt, um, you know, if you just don't panic and just take it cool, you can do it, no damage, easily there, so, yeah. Okay, now that we're done with Guts, man, let me just once again get it down. Completed. Now we'll go to Bomb Man here, I have decided. There we go. And, actually, let me just check here. Seven minutes. Okay, this video is seemingly going to be a little bit longer, but I guess that's fine. Let's just try and do this in a fashionable time, I guess. Let's try and hit that 15 to 20 minute mark here. Or mark, whatever. <laughs> and this soundtrack is really... Really weird, actually. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, it's all calm here at the start. Da -da. <laughs> Ooh, this here is a pretty cool room. Yeah, wow, it's so slowed down, the track. Whoops. Yeah, the eye slasher, dude, it's so, so efficient. Look at this. Boom. Boom. Very awesome. Yeah, wow, those speedrunning strats there. Hey, dude, is this shell guy going to kill me here? That would be embarrassing to say the least. Um, wait. Oh, okay, I handled it very poorly. Whoops. Fire just a smidge too early. Yeah, those yo guys there, sniper yo's, they are Pretty hard to jump over, but yeah. You can definitely do it, I noticed. Um, I've been trying, you know, lately, to, you know, to get better at it because, yeah, it's just a very nice feeling to jump over them. Instead of having to sit there and fight them, you know, slowly. Whoa! Dang it! I wanted to try and do this. Hmm. 
I was all excited to see the health there and then, you know, the Octobatter just went ahead and gave me that BS health. Whoa, look at that! And this, yep! Yeah. Pretty cool boss entrance there, I have to say. You know, let's just check here. Nope, he's actually not weak to that. Nor that. Wait, have I even... Wait, they haven't done Time Man yet. Oh god, I should not have fired that. Okay, now I'm all frazzled here. Is it the oil weapon? Dang it, I wanna know! Dude! Well, he's immune to it either way, so... Immune to that. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome! You know, the cutter actually makes sense because you cut off the... You cut off the bomb uh, fuse there, you know. Yeah, the game developers, you know, for Capcom should have thought of that. Hm. Okay, I just wanted to see what his weakness were. Since I was curious and all. And yeah, I took a bunch of damage trying to find it, but... Yeah, that's another one down. Bombman completed. Yeah, but no, finally we'll go to Time Man here, so I can stop accidentally using it, you know? Alright. And now we can actually use all weapons here. I believe. Let me just check here real quick. Yeah, only Time Man is left unchecked this far on my list here. Very nice. Which is not really necessary. I'll just skip on by. Yeah, so far the game has been incredibly easy. Like, only the Elec Man. Whoa, <laughs> I, that was poorly, poorly timed by me. Only the Elec Man stage, you know, have had some really, you know, tricky platforming there with the. What are they called? With the foot holder guys there. Like, yeah, Elec Man stage. Actually, yeah, it offers some challenge there with those jumps there, that's, that's for sure. Dang it. You know, yet again there, if you're Pearl Man you can just slide on through, but as Mega Man you have to take a step back there. there with the crush maces or whatever they are called yeah I'm just getting that because I can not because I need it oh oh yo yo just kind of tapping the controller there <laughs> in Conjunction with the music there. Hmm. How the heck do I do this? I'm actually not sure. Oh, like that. Uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. Hmm. Some precision bombing. Hey, dude, these guys always get me. I don't know if I've been able to dodge a single one of them yet. And, oh, I was about to say, how do I get that, but yeah. Obviously, it's the main theme. Oh, jeez. Here we 
and we're going to want to be a little bit careful. Okay, I made that out to be harder than it actually was. <laughs> Yeah, I like that section there. It was a little bit more developed than the previous ones there. <laughs> you see, I basically had my cannon, you know, up to his mouth and just pumped him full of levels there. That was, yeah, that was cruel. I'm not very good at fighting Time Man here, I have to admit. He's actually one of the few bosses that I'm not sure how to dodge him, you know, properly. Like, he just, yeah, he just kind of <laughs> chases, chases me down and, you know, gets me into a corner and, you know, either he hurts me or he doesn't. But yeah, he's really hard to react to and he's quite hard to jump over as well. And I don't know if there is like a pattern to when he's about to jump. Like, with Cutman, you know, he when he gets close to you, he always jumps over you. Um, I don't know if Time Man, you know, has a pattern like that. I'm not sure. Usually I just beat him by brute forcing it. Alright, but yeah, that will be do it for the third video there. So, yeah, in the next two episodes, or maybe I'll just... Yeah, maybe I'll just play all the wild stages in one video. I might just go ahead and do that, you know. Yeah. <laughs> we have, we'll have a big finale there. Let's, let's just do all the videos. Let's... <laughs> all the videos. Let's just do all the stages in one video there. So, yeah. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool stuff. Let's just upload that one as well. So, yeah. In the next video, we'll be continuing on with the wild stages. So, yeah. See you then.